Hey guys, welcome back to this brand new upload here on the channel of Game Some Life. And because the latest tryhard outfits, basically the couple's outfit was highly requested and it went really good on the channel, I'll be featuring another couple tryhard outfit in this video of today. So this video will basically be showcasing a 10 male and female outfits working off the latest patch of 1.46 it has been done with the outfit transfer glitch like most of the videos here on the channel. So I hope you guys like this 10 beach tryhard outfits and let's get straight into the male part. So we're going to start off with the male components and the full male outfit. So for that you must do the outfit transfer glitch. The link will be in the description box down below. So if you're not familiar with this glitch, make sure you check that video first of all and just follow the steps until you are at the point where you have to create the comp components. It's that easy to do. So in this video I will only be showcasing the components and then I'm just going to show you how to create it and how to merge it. You have to do the transfer glitch all yourself. So uh, for the female components we're going to be starting on the second female character. We're going to transfer female to male, so first of all go over to the shoe section, go to the high heel boots and put on the deluxe midnight combat boots. Then we're moving over to the pants section, you want to go to the sports pants and put on the spotted muscle pants. Now these are the current merging pants and will allow us to merge the tanned team pants on the outfits. So then we're going over to the top, you want to go to the leather jackets and put on the blue cropped biker. Now this is a merge sub component. So it will allow us to merge the turtleneck sweater of transferring. And then we're just going over to the bust shears and you want to put on the teal lace bust shear. Now this will just be a simple white fest shirt which will be glitching through our turtleneck. So these are basically the components. This is all you have to do for this 10 beach tryhard outfit. So just save it anywhere in your save it outfits list. Now I suggest saving it on slot number one because it is a merging outfit. Now you can fill up the rest of the outfit slots with other components, but do not make like merging components. Just make solid components so that after transferring you can just simply put the outfit on. That's all you have to do. So if you got it saved and you got your other components only outfit saved, whatever that you want, you can now transfer the outfits over to the male. So just simply put on a standard outfit for the female character. Walk outside of the closed door and just transfer the outfits over to the male. Now like I said the tutorial for that will be in the description box down below. So if you have absolutely no clue how to transfer, check that video out. I'm just going to transfer these outfits over to my male character and then I'll see you guys in a second. So once you are back here on the male character and you see that the outfits have successfully transferred over, we can now go ahead and just merge this outfit and just finish it all up. So the only thing you have to do on the male character is just apply these team pants right here. These will be the 10 combat pants, so make sure you do apply them. These are the pants that we're going to be merging on our transferred outfits. And for the tops, all you have to do is just simply go over to the sweaters and you want to put on this 10 turtleneck basically. And this one will go straight through or white vest shirts. So I just put on the beige turtleneck, this one right here on number 67. And if you got that on, you, you do not have to like save this outfit. You can just keep this outfit on because if you have the outfit save it on slot number one, we can just simply merge this on slot number one. So if you got your turtleneck and your team pants on and you have the outfit save it on slot number one, just keep this outfit on. All you have to do is walk outside of the clothes store. Make sure you are in a public session and just simply start up Crooked Cop. Now you can find this job under the first jobs of the Rockstar Created Jobs. So if you have found Crooked Cop, just simply start it up. Now if you spawn with other players, make sure they have set clothing over to player own it. And if you are hosting Crooked Cop, also make sure that you set clothing to player own it. So we can access that transferred outfits. So if you have found a Crooked Cop which has set clothing to player own it, or if you have a player who is willing to join and play um, the job with you, just simply launch up Crooked Cop and wait until you are on the following screen. 
Now once you're on the screen right here, all you have to do is scroll to own it outfit and just go once to the right and you should see the white fast shirt glitching through and the team pants appear. Now the white shoes will also be underneath, just simply hit ready to play and just take the outfit straight inside Crooked Cop. So once you are offloaded here inside of Crooked Cop, all we have to do is just make sure that it sticks. So just hold down your touchpad, you want to go over to style, go to accessories and just simply put anything on so the outfit saves. Now I just put on this black t-shirt mask right there. You can just also put on a pair of gloves if you want to, as long as this outfit sticks. So if you've changed anything on the outfit, just simply pull up the phone and wait until you spawn back inside an online session. So once you spawn back, you can now just simply finish off the outfit just like you've seen on the thumbnail. Or if you want to add different things, then you can do it. As you can see, you can just change anything on this outfit on the male character that you want. You can add a different pair of gloves if you want. You can also put on a uh, mask, a different mask if you want to. Or some other things, whatever you like, you can just simply put it on this outfit. But do make sure that you actually save it. So I'm just going to save it on top of the transferred outfit right there. And all I'm going to do is just add a 10 bulletproof helmet on this outfit. On top of the t-shirt mask. So also I will be putting on a parachute. I will be purchasing that later on. So now we're just moving over to the female version of this outfit. And then yeah, we're just going to do the whole female outfit. So now we're moving over to the female version of this outfit and this one is a little bit different than the other one of course. So this will be the opposite. So the main character has to be a female one and the second character has to be a newly created male character which we are going to be creating these components on. So I've already explained it how the transfer glitch works. The link will be in the description so I'm just going to show you the components straight. So. On the male character, first of all, we move into the top section. From here, you want to go to the smart jackets and put on this green quilted jacket. Now, this one will be a um, turtleneck top. So, basically, the beige turtleneck top that we also have on the male, this one will be it. So, if you got that um, smart jacket on, you now want to scroll the way down to the designer t-shirts and put on the Pegasus t-shirt. Now this will be a white business shirt component. So it will just go straight through the turtleneck just like you have seen on the male one. So then we're moving over to the pants. You want to go to the sports shorts and put on the tropical print running sports shorts. Now these will be the current merging pants for the female character in order to merge our team pants on the outfits. And then for the shoes, we're just going to the skate shoes and you want to put on these red skate shoes, which will be the off-white skate shoes on the female character, which will have like the tan beige appearance. Okay, so this will basically be the outfit for the female character, which we're going to be transferring. So just simply save it anywhere in your save it outfit slots. I'm just call, going to call it 10 beach again with the number one in front of it. So... If you got this outfit, save it, then you're good to go. All you have to do is fill up the rest of the outfit slots with other outfits that you want to transfer. Make sure they are single components only, so no merch items included. And if you got that all set up, you're ready to transfer. All you have to do is apply a standard male outfit, just like you see here in the gameplay. And then you can make your way outside of the clothes store. And if you are outside of the clothes store, all you have to do is just transfer the outfits over. So like I said, the tutorial for the transfer glitch is in the description box down below. So check that out if you do not know how to transfer. I'm just quickly going to transfer them over to the female character and then I'll see you guys in a second. So once you are back here on the female character, we're just going to be doing the same thing. So we're going to merge using Crooked Cop. So all you have to do is just apply these 10 combat pants again from the team pan selection on the female character. We do not have to merge the top this time because it was a component. So do not save it, just sim simply keep this outfit on as it is. And then you can go to pause, you can go to online jobs, play job, rockstar created. Go to verses and from here you will see crooked cop and just simply go over there. So if you're hosting Crooked Cop, like I mentioned it with the meal outfit, make sure you set clothing over to play your own it. And if you're joining somebody, make sure that they have also put clothing over to play your own it. 
So if you got that set, you can just wait for the host to like launch off Crooked Cop or else just simply hit confirm settings and from this point just invite a player so you can go ahead and launch up Crooked Cop. So once you have someone who can go ahead and help you out or if the host has launched up the job, wait until you are on the following screen right here and um, you will see own it outfits. Now on the screen all you have to do is just scroll over to own it outfit like I mentioned and just simply go once to the right and you should see your white um, shirt together with the beige uh, turtleneck and you will see your team pants. So also the shoes will appear in a second. All you have to do is hit ready to play and just simply take this outfit straight inside of Crooked Cup. So once you have launched it here inside of Crooked Cup, just hold down your interaction menu, go to style, accessories and just simply put on a repeater, a mask or just put on some gloves like I mentioned it before in order to like save the outfit and make sure that it sticks. So I'm just going to put on the gloves that I want and I'm just going to be putting on a repeater. And if you did all that then you can now simply pull up your phone and just quit Crooked Cup and wait until you spawn back in an online session. And once you spawn back in with the female, you can now basically do the same thing. You can just go back over to the clothes store. You can just finish off the outfit the way that it is. So if you want to like put on a helmet and make it the same as like the male outfits, you can do that to make it like a really good matching couple beach tryhard outfits. So this finishes off the tutorial for both the male and the female outfits. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like if it worked for you. Subscribe to the channel of Games on Live for more glitches and upcoming videos. And of course, I hope to see you back in the next video here on the channel. Bye everyone!